Hell Creek, Montana. This strange landscape holds a secret. Buried in the rocks is ancient treasure, the skeleton of a T-Rex. Greg Wilson and his team have been carefully excavating it since 2015. First things that were, were discovered were pieces of vertebrae, ribs, uh, parts of the pelvis. Um, and then as we dug in, we discovered the back of the skull and traced that forward to uh, the jawbone that had teeth pointing up. Wilson believes this T-Rex is one of the most complete ever discovered. And clues on the bones raise the possibility that it fell prey to another T-Rex. On its lower jaw, it does have uh, indications of, of wounds and injuries through battles with perhaps other T-Rexes. After two years of painstaking work, the dig is almost complete. But it's only when you piece all the bones together that the true terror of T-Rex becomes clear. Paleontologist Eric Snively is one of the many scientists in awe of these giant killers. Henry Fairfield Osborne, who named T-Rex, wanted to give it a very evocative name, and so he named it Tyrant Lizard King, and it sort of says it all. Here we have a carnivorous animal, the, the mass of an elephant and the height of a giraffe, just massive and powerful beyond our imagining. Weighing in at nine tons, T-Rex was a muscle machine. The lower jaw alone could lift the weight of nearly 10 pickup trucks. And even its tiny looking arms could bicep curl 400 pounds. This huge brawn enabled T-Rex to take down truly massive prey in the form of a five-ton Triceratops. Triceratops was strong and heavily armored. Penetrating the seven-foot shield around its head represented a formidable challenge, except for the teeth of T-Rex. The teeth of Tyrannosaurus rex are very, very thick. It's not like a scalpel, like a human surgeon or someone like that with a scalpel gingerly cutting through flesh. They were like railroad spikes. They were good for taking a lot of bite force. And in fact, some recent research shows that a Tyrannosaurus rex was biting with about 400,000 pounds per square inch. That's the weight of 400 grand pianos pressing down on the teeth. In fact, it could bite so hard, it would crush its own skull if it weren't for one simple adaptation. Tyrannosaurs have a unique nose. The bone on the bridge of their snout, called the nasal bone, was fused. So as they bit down, the nasal bone enabled all of the force of the bite to be transmitted to the prey and held everything together to handle the blast of this bite force. The jaws of T-Rex deliver the strongest bite of any animal to walk the earth. 